Hey, JCPS, happy Friday and happy end to week number three of NTI. Uh, appreciate all the work once again, parents, families, students, teachers and staff. I know everyone is putting in a whole lot of hours to make sure that our kids have the support they need and are successful. And we can't thank you enough for all of that great work. And we are seeing some incredible percentages of participation out there. Week one, 94%. Um, and week two is right there. It was at 93% earlier in the year, and we'll get that final number um, by early in the week. And we, we believe that we're hearing great percentages out of week three, too. So thanks to everybody for that work. We had a board meeting earlier um, this week um, where, once again, we solidified the final day of school. As you know, the governor on Monday gave the recommendation that we would finish out the school year in NTI. Um, and our final day of school will now be May 27th, Wednesday, May 27th. So we will be in NTI um, from the end of this week until May 27th. And I know we'll have four more great weeks of NTI instruction to make sure that we're successful. And we're seeing things like 86,000 kids in week two logged into their Google Classroom. And just those numbers alone are showing um, such high levels of participation. And once again, I want to thank everybody for that. Also, the amount of meals we're serving each and every day, and I know I talk about this every single week, but last week, this past week, we went over half a million meals served to JCPS students. So we'll continue to do that as long as we need to till we are able to get back into school. We are turning our focus, obviously, as well, supporting NTI, but making sure that we prepare for summer learning for our students. Um, and whether we can do that in person or virtually, we're gonna make sure that we continue to support our students in summer learning after we're out of school on May 27th. Um, so as you can see, it's been a busy week. People are still working really hard to support our kids. And once again, I can't thank our families and staff um, enough and our students for all their great work. Seniors, class of 2020, once again, um, I wanna reiterate that commitment to you to making sure that we get you a commencement at some point. We don't know when that'll be. We'll take guidance from that, but we're gonna do a lot of opportunities to celebrate our seniors, the class of 2020, here before the end of NTI on the 27th. We're going to work on celebrating you in multiple ways. I had a meeting this week uh, with a large group of seniors virtually to get their feedback. We'll continue to do that. We'll celebrate you, and then we'll have a commencement when it is safe to do that so that we can honor your great accomplishments of the class of 2020. And finally, anybody out there, staff, students, families, join us today. Uh, usually I have a superintendent run club on a Friday afternoon. Today was a scheduled day to do that, April 24th. Unfortunately, as you know, we cannot get together, but we can have a virtual run club. We are, are getting a lot of pictures on social media um, with the hashtag JCPS Super Strong. Uh, join us. Um, get outside. Uh, the weather's nice today. Take a run, a walk, or whatever it is you do to stay healthy. Snap a picture of that and make sure to uh, post that online. As soon as I get out of here, I'm gonna get my running clothes on and I'm gonna uh, go for a run and I'll make sure to post some pictures as well. So let's stay healthy together. Let's have the first ever virtual run club today. Let's see those pictures, get outside and get some exercise and let us know how you do it. It's all a part of being this JCPS family. Appreciate all your work. Have a great weekend. Looking forward to seeing you next week, probably virtually, but uh, looking forward to all the great work in NTI week four. Thanks and have a great weekend.